What's up YouTube? I'm going to be making a tutorial on how to do zoom in a better Fulbright. This Fulbright is going to be like better than most of them. Most of them are, is, it's like too bright, but this one's going to be normally like the middle of the day. Alright, so first we're going to make font reader. Or, hmm. Nah, I'm just going to get quick with this tutorial. Um, I'm going to need a variable class. I'm going to make a new pub public static boolean public static boolean uh, let's do zoom equal false now the false means if it's going to be toggled if you put true then it's going to be toggled right away when you start up the game when it's false it won't and you can uh, check it alright once you got that you're going to go down to entity uh, entity render Pretty sure. Is that it? NTD render. You're gonna find public static or public void update render. Alright, sure right. once you're here, I'm gonna make a toggle. And but if uh, tutorial, you can you can put the classes whatever you want. You can put variables, vars. My other my clients on this one just making I'm making a new menu. It's not uh, my other one's quick clickable, but I'm not gonna show that one. It takes too long. But mine's named tutorial because I'm doing tutorials on this, and we're gonna do zoom because it's what we put right here. Now I'm gonna open it up and you're gonna put camera right, camera zoom equals three point five D semicolon. And then at this bracket we're gonna put else else bracket camera now what the else does is this camera zoom 3.5 is what when you toggle it on it's going to go 3.5 but whenever you untoggle it it's going to go back to 1.0 the normal alright now that's that's our zoom right there that's pretty simple right and we're going to be doing the better Fulbright in this class. We're not going to be doing any of the x-ray type of Fulbright. But let's test out uh, Zoom. Um, I'm going to make a font right there. I don't feel like it. But let's do Ram key K. Change this to Tutorial Tutorial dot zoom equal exclamation part exclamation mark tutorial dot zoom now what the what this does is it toggles it and the exclamation mark d toggles it and let's just save it so k is our keybind Alright, here's normal. Now let's press K. And there it is. You got this. And I'm pretty sure if you press F8, it goes slower. So you can, uh, you you don't code this, but if you press F8, it, it's like kind of slow mo. So it, it's kind of like a sniper mode. You can change the uh, 3.5 to whatever you want. So like, I think they did this with the gun mods, where if you're zooming in, it kind of zooms in, but that's it. Press K, D toggles it, but let me press F8. All right, it's back to normal. All right, there we go. X this off. Now, real quick, I'm gonna oh no. All right, 
gun jokes or variables class public static boolean uh, what do we want to do oh yeah fb for full byte equals false yeah. now in NTD render press f or control f that's the search button or you can just go up to one of these and but we're gonna type in float f12 equals mc dot game set things and settings the s is capitalized settings dot gamma settings symbol right there <clears throat> now right here what we're going to do is we're going to change it to this Float 12 equals tutorial tutorial dot fb question mark one zero 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 f semicolon space mc dot game uh, settings dot gamma settings. now semicolon and wait Hold on one second, I got a code. Let me pause the video real quick. Sorry guys, what it was is I didn't put the semicolon. That was all. Alright. Now we got that. So we're gonna go to our GUI in game, put our check key in. Just do a copy. Um L Let's do all you have to do is change this to Epi. Change this to B. No. All right, L is our check key. L, check it out. Looks pretty. Looks like daytime almost. It's just the water is a little bit different. See, kind of, kind of through it a little bit better. But that's the X Sherry and the Zoom. Hope you liked it. Please subscribe and comment what you want next. See ya.